We have these robots set up so that this is at the user side robot is controlling a task side robot. Usually, the way robots will work is um, the user side moves the task side and you don't feel what happens back here. But these are set up so that um, when Alejandra is holding it here at the user side, she can feel what's happening at the task side. It's giving her that haptic feedback about what's happening in the environment. We've had a long research program exploring using robots in different aspects of play, whether it be uh, object play or even using things in education, because there's a lot of manipulation that needs to be done in, in learning early concepts. Over time, you realize that there are limitations with the interfaces, and so we wanted to address that one limitation about not being able to feel at your own interface what's happening in the environment. What I'd love to see down the line is, is when someone is using a wheelchair, say, and they have an interface on their wheelchair, and a robot in the environment that can manipulate things and go wherever the person wants it to, and feedback all the information that it can. Um, I'd love to see every child who needs one, have one.